Today we are going to talk about uh, my favorite modifier which I generally use for fashion photography for portfolio shoots even for uh, some time we use it for wedding if the location is quite good and we can use it on outdoor Hello guys, my name is Gaurav Madan and welcome to my channel. Uh, before going to our topic, let me tell you, you can subscribe to my channel and you can get some photography tutorials and reviews on this channel. And you can follow me on Instagram, that is Madangaro Arts, given in the description below. And also you can see my profile on my website, which is www.madangaroarts.com. So today we have Godox Octa 120. Generally, uh, this Octa is, uh, we have different size in this. So starting range from I guess it is from 40 cm then 60 cm and 80 cm but generally we use uh, 120 cm for fashion photography because we need to like keep more lighting and we need to spread that light overall so we are using this big modifier so 80 cm octa you can generally use for product shoot or a kind of uh, food photography or if you are if you are just shooting portrait shoots or like kind of head shots then you can use 80 centimeter if you're doing fashion shoots or portfolio shoots you may need to use 120 centimeter because it will give a good and a big spread okay so let's go and watch how to arrange your godox octa 120 so uh, we have this uh, godox octa uh, it, it it really comes in very uh, portable way so you can carry this with you anywhere so you can even keep in your vehicle or any car if you are traveling somewhere so it is really portable that you can use it really anywhere okay so let's start and just check it out what we have here so uh, this is your Godox Octa and uh, this is almost like your umbrella what uh, you are using your weddings and all. So this is basically an umbrella setup doing setup of this is really easy. Uh, before that let me tell you we have here one, uh, one basic stand and we have a clamp, clamp over here which is of uh, Godox which we have discussed in, in uh, accessories flash kit. So that is the clamp of uh, Godox only. Okay. So sometimes there is an issue that we have some clamps, but the thickness of uh, umbrella is not that much big. So this is actually used for this octa. Okay. So let me just show you how we can uh, set up this. Okay. So we have this uh, simple thing. What we have in umbrella. And we can simply and we can simply open this in this way and here we go okay once we open this we have uh, another thing here which is we have chain so we can simply open this thing so we have a chain here so we can put this simply in your stand and we can attach this okay so once we keep this chain <clears throat> we can simply attach this in your clamp of umbrella so here we go <clears throat> this is our octa uh, godox octa umbrella so it is very easy to you know set it up and it it has a uh, silver coated inside so you can uh, use it uh, without diffuser we have two diffusers here so one we can put over here inside and one on the outer side so let's see okay so this is our diffuser so we can simply open it up so we can simply open it up and we can just take it to the outer part of octa so 
so here your octa is ready so you can uh, take it anywhere simply anywhere so uh, in case of traveling it's very easy and useful to use it to set up it and just go on your shoot okay so uh, we have this Godok V862 uh, for Nikon and uh, let me tell you how we can set up your flash for this octa so uh, generally uh, for any softbox for any mod modifier we generally use this light on your uh, for this face light so the direction is on outer part but here as we have this silver coated material we have to use this as an uh, the, the direction will be inside okay so simply uh, we can uh, set up your flash and here we go okay so once this your flash gets fired you will get a good spread and you will get a good uh, diffused light but still if you want to make it more diffuse you can simply use diffuser over here so which is on outer part of it then you will get more soft light on your subject okay so yeah that was it that was uh, the octa 120 this is basically i'm using for passion because for fashion we need uh, big stuff but for product and uh, kind of food photography or uh, for high shots you can use um, 60 or 80 centimeter this is basically 120 centimeter so you can go for 80 centimeter if you are doing some product of wood shoot okay so that was only the thing about uh, godox octa 120 thank you so much for watching this video if you have any questions regarding this you can please comment below and for more videos you can subscribe to our channel and please do subscribe and you can follow me on instagram madangaro arts and you can see my profile on my website given below www.madangaroarts.com have a good day thank you so much